to a new video everybody. Today we're going to be swapping out the stock hood vents on the Stinger for some nice carbon fiber hydro dipped vents. I've also got some other carbon fiber stuff that we're going to be adding to the car but first let's go ahead and pop the hood and see how to get these old vents out of there. Alrighty so first we want to go ahead and take enough of these clips off of this covering so that we can reach inside and access the vents. You can take the whole covering off if you want to but know that it's not completely necessary. Okay, so you really only need to pull these three off that are on the outside edge to be able to get in there to the nuts to take off. And as you can see here, flip this over, these are a little bit different than the other clips used in the car. You have to push in both of these sides to be able to get the clip loose. I accidentally busted one, but that's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and use a clip like that to push back up in there when I'm finished. But yeah, we need to go ahead and loosen the three nuts. I'm not sure why that one doesn't have a nut on it. Uh, I guess weight reduction, but anyway, we need to loosen those three and then we will basically just put the new vent on and then tighten those three back down. We've got all that loose before we go prying on the vent we can go ahead and take a look at the bottom of this one and see that there are clips going all the way around so you want to take a detailing tool or a detailing card and just kind of shove it under the sides where the clips are on these ones and work them loose on one side and then you'll be able to pull it out without busting any of them Now, one thing I did to help get the pry bar in there is push through this hole, push up a little bit on the vent, and that'll give you a little bit of clearance when you're trying to pry those clips out of there. And yeah, I don't get why this side has four nuts, but anyway, yeah. So we're gonna do that same thing on this side, and then we'll close everything back up and get onto all the other stuff. and the new vents are in and I've got to say I really love this carbon fiber on matte black look and if we wanted to go a step further and customize the little silver strips in the middle you can actually take those off by unscrewing those three screws in the middle and then wrapping it hydro dipping it whatever you wanted to do to it for some reason when I was going through the editing process I noticed that the video where I put on these overlays for the brake vents was missing. It's literally just an overlay though so it will go on top of what you currently have for the brake vent. There are full carbon fiber ones where you can pull the whole vent out and then put the new one in there but I figured the overlay looked pretty good with the half black and half carbon fiber.
Alrighty, and that's gonna do it for the cosmetic mods today. I do have another spoiler. I'll be taking that one off and swapping it out for a carbon fiber one, uh, but that's going to be after I get it wrapped in some of the uh, matte black wrapping that I have on the hood, and then the roof will also be getting done. But that, that'll be another video. So uh, thank you guys so much for stopping by and checking out the video. If you have any questions about anything that I installed, let me know in the comments. I'll be leaving links for everything down in the description below. Again, thanks so much for stopping by and checking out the video. And I hope to see you in my next one.